good day guys it's promise was in here once again okay okay uh i'm going to be talking about i told you guys i'll be talking about something today i'm going to be talking about the style button i'm sure most of you do see this button steady on your puzzle lab but you definitely might not be using it or for the creative ones they might have touched it okay, so for those that don't know about it we are going to be unveiling its function today okay look at it here go to your alphabetical menu here you see the style button look at the style button so this is it so look at the function of this type button okay let me explain first before i show you guys when you type in maybe you you got a plp from someone or maybe you typed a text and mistakenly you forgot the font and the style you use on the text you can just save it in this type button and once you go there you can apply to any new one you get let me show you guys okay see this is a new test now this is a new test let me increase the size okay you see this is my one here this one is an alphabet this one i use for the design is an alphabet so let me copy the style of this one first one wait let me know the one which is okay, so this is the one okay I click this one i go to this style you see you see two buttons here you see browse you see save this browse browse takes you to uh, your style menu you have your default and you have my styles the default one is the styles that people have have already then my styles is the one you've saved all these styles are the ones i've saved so far i've been designing so these are the styles i've saved so far so you get to default you see the ones of puzzle lab so if you are done selecting this you press ok to go ahead. then this is not the one i'm going to i'm not going to be using any one i saved here. i'm going to be using a new one here so this is the one here i go to this style i click it press this save button here i press it you see save the current test as new style press ok see what will happen now if i go to this style i go to browse i go to my style you see this style now here this is this current one now that i just saved here see, that is the style for it so if i'm to type another one now if i'm to get another one let's say this is my new test now i change it to one change the text to one i press done i press ok it's kind of lost anyway but let me use relative relative alignment to bring it out it's out now so you see i've saved that style now you see what will happen now i want to affect this same style in this one now everything font and everything in this other one so i go to the style button here go to browse and go to my style you see it here where i saved it i click on it you see it adds the effect on it you know why it's not like this one the other one it's because because this one is bigger than this one let me get this one to the exact size this one was that one is 426 let's get something of 426 426 you see we we'll have the exact one we we'll have here 426 okay you see it it's now exact you see it it's exactly the same you have reduced the size so this is it you can get a plp from someone and you don't know the font they they use on it just tap the test we tap the even though the font is not on puzzle lab even though you don't have the font on puzzle lab you can just tap the test go to this save here you go to save this style button sorry you if you click it you see two buttons here you see browse you see save you use this one to save the style is this one to browse the one you've saved already this is the default from Pizora. we don't need it you go to your style this is the styles i've saved so far so this is a very nice so most of the times i might be designing and i get to a point i forget the fonts i used while i started the design so i'll just go to this style save it and then impl implement it in the other text i'm going to add 
so it's very very easy i know most most of you might have tried this style or as i've been using it and some are not using it but if you've not known of it or if you've not used it go try it now okay so thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to share the video and uh, subscribe have a nice day